Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create teleporters in Unreal Engine 4 to teleport the players from one place to another place at the same map and also transfer the player from one place to another map. So I just create this new project. This is my new game project and this is a third person player project third person game and this is the main avatar third person means if I play then you can view from a third person view all right so now I'm going to create a teleporter here then I want to make it teleport to another corner of the wall all right so now I'm going to start I just opened this new project. First I have to I have to press F. Now for example here. I press F. I want to create a teleporter here. First what should I do? I will just create a, a simple cube first. Alright. I make this cube as a teleporter but actually this is just to display the things that I want to create is the trigger box I will put a trigger box here then the player have to stand onto this cube this is a trigger box so I must set the blueprint here Make sure you already select the trigger box. Next, you press here, click here, and open the level blueprint. Next, at here, this is the level blueprint. First, you just need to right click and add the event for the trigger box one collisions. Add on actor begin overlap. Alright, next, what I'm going to do is I drag this execute exec, drag it out, and then here I search for teleport. Sorry. Then you can see a function that teleports. Next. So where should you teleport to? This is the destination location. Right. Now, you return to your map. Alright. This one I minimize first. So I'm going to create another cube here, the plane. For example, or I can create a cube as well. I put a cube here. Okay. Sorry, I delete the cube. No need this cube. I just want to create an empty actor. Drag an empty actor here. Now, this one already selected. I can just rename it F2 to rename it destination 01. So now destination 01 is selected. This is an empty actor. Back to the blueprint. Next, right click here. Create a reference to destination 01. Then, then you, you cannot drag this blue color to the yellow. You can see this blueprint, this is blue color and this is yellow color. So you have to set another thing.
get actors locations. All right, this one. Or you can just drag out and search it. Get actor locations. Like this. So return value, where is the location of the destination 01? Just drag this to here. Right. Okay. So the destination location will automatically set as the destination 01's location. Like in the map here. Next. The target. The tar the target should be yourself. Drag out. Get player character. Alright. Just like that only. So it done. Let us test it. First you have to click compile and then file save. Then now I can minimize this and now I'm going to test the game. Try to play. Alright, so the teleporter should be here. See, success already. Now I already successfully teleport the player from one place to another place at the same map. As long as the player touch this box, this is a teleporter. Alright, I press escape. Alright, now next what we are going to test is create a teleporter to teleport to another map. Now you click the contents, the third person blueprint and check the map. Now you only have one map, this is your map. Now we are going to create another level, what do you call another map. Map is level, level is map. We can say in this way, in the third person game. So just need to click file, new level. And for this time, I'm going to select the VR basic. Then, save the selected. Alright, now it, it is going to load to another map. First, I'm going to save this map. Save at the same location here. This location is third person BP. Under the map folder, this is the new map. New map 01. Safe. Now you can see this map already at here. It is under content, third person, VP, maps. So just now your map is here. Sorry, your third person example map. This is just now this one. And now we're going to a new map. From this new map, I'm going to create a teleporter as well. I want, I want it to teleport to this map. So, back to the previous map. I want to create another teleporter here. I will do the same thing, same way. Here, F. So, I want to create another teleporter here. I, I will just drag a cube. Just make it as a mark. So that you will easily see that the teleporter is here. Then, what you really need actually is the trigger box. Drag, tr drag another trigger box. Then, this is the trigger box 2. Under the trigger box 2, you must select first and then do the same way click the blueprint and open level blueprint. For this, for this time, you are going to teleport to another map. So, just now you already have this. You better add a comment. You select all, right click, create a comment for these selections. This is teleporter within the map. Alright, but now we are going to create another teleporter that is transferred from one map to another map. So first what you need to do, make sure you already selected the trigger box to this one. And right click. 
add event for trigger box 2 collisions add on actor begin overlap this you can you can see this is the bracket this bracket is just for the trigger box 2 and next what are you going to do is you need to cast the third person, so drag it out, cast third person, cast, sorry, cast to third person, cast to third person character. And then this one, other actor also drag to here. And then here you drag out to execute open level. Open level here you have to key in your map name. What is the map name? Where you want him to teleport to. Alright. The map name should be exactly the same. The map name, the level name is a case sensitive, so you must you must rename it, you must name it properly. F2 and I copy this map, Control C to copy. And I click here one time and double time, it turn blue, then I control V to paste here. New map 01. After that, this one. I'm going to select all, all of them and add a command as well. Create a command. This is a teleporter. From level to level. Or map to map. What do you call map to map? Map to map teleporter. Now, click compile and file save. Now I'm going to test play. Test to play this game. Right, I just play. You can see this teleporter is, is the teleporter just now. It's going to teleport to another corner of the wall. But now I already created another teleporter. This teleporter is to teleport to another map. See, it, it really immediately transferred the player to another map. All right. So at the same time, this map I, I have to save first, and, and in another map, that is the new map 01, I have to create another teleporter here. So I will just put a plane, a plane as well, or I will just put a cube here to create another teleporter here. Maybe I put at the corner. All right, then I will drag another box trigger and make sure this box trigger is selected. And also do the same way. It's under blueprint, open level blueprint. So here I I will also create the same thing. Right click, add the event for trigger box 1. For this time, I'm going to transfer the player from this map to another map as well. Add on actor begin overlap. Alright, this one. Next, drag, drag here out. Search for cast to third person. Correct. Link, link the other actor to object as well, and also drag it out. Drag it out here and open level. The level name should be the map just now. That is a third person example map. I, I can just press F2, Control C to copy the file name, and back to the blueprint here. Control Sorry, click here, Control V to paste and enter. Now compile and file save. And I can 
minimize the blueprint already. Now I try to test play the game. For every of the map, you make sure make sure all the map have this. Alright, what is this? That is the starting of, of the player. The, the player will be start here. Make sure the, the map that you want to teleport through must have the player start. Otherwise, you don't know where to teleport the player. Now I try to play. Now I'm in this, this new map. I'm going to find the teleporter here. Now it teleport it teleport to this map. And this is the teleporter that will teleport the player within the map to another corner. And also another teleporter is here. This teleporter is to teleport to the new map 01. So now you can see very amazing. I already created a teleporter to link two levels together to link two maps together. Then when you design the game, the teleporter is, is an event that's really, really important, especially you can just make it a, as a door event as well. You put a door there, as long as the player approach the, lock, the door and touch, touch the box trigger, then it automatically transfer into a room. Alright, that's all for today about how to create a teleporter to transfer players from one place to another place in the same map and also transfer a player from one, one level to another level to different map. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell to activate the notification so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive the notification immediately. See you in my next video, enjoy and happy animation.